FAFSA stands for Free Application for Federal Student Aid. You need to fill it out every year to be considered eligible for grants, work study, and student loans. The FAFSA is available October 1st each year, and you are encouraged to file early. Millersville University has a priority deadline of March 15th. If you are a Pennsylvania resident, make sure to file your FAFSA by May 1st each year. You can complete the FAFSA online at studentaid.gov in under 30 minutes. And best of all, it's free to apply. Here are five main tips for filling out your FAFSA. Tip one, to complete your application, you will need an FSA ID number and password to electronically sign your FAFSA. The FSA ID and password is your secure digital signature. Parents and students need separate IDs and should not be shared. You will need this to renew your FAFSA each year, complete loan documents, and access federal websites. If you forget your FSA ID or password, don't worry, you can easily retrieve it. Tip two, the FAFSA has three sets of questions to answer. Personal information about the student, such as their name, email, marital status, and school information. Financial information about their income and assets. And potentially personal and financial information of a legal parent or guardian. Tip three. To complete these sections, you will need a social security number, an alien registration number if you are not a US citizen, a federal income tax return, W-2s, and any other records that show money earned. Tip four. Here are some important reminders when filling out your information. To send your FAFSA information to Millersville, make sure to include our school code, 003325. You will need to use your income and tax information from two years prior. If you didn't file a federal tax return, you can still complete a FAFSA. You will just indicate that you did not file taxes and list any income earned. You may be able to use the IRS data retrieval tool to speed up the application process since your taxes are already completed. The IRS data retrieval tool lets you securely transfer tax return information directly from the IRS into your FAFSA. Tip five. At the end of your application, make sure you have electronically signed your application using your FSA ID and password. If you are required to provide parental information, they will need to sign it too. Make sure you click Submit. If you are a Pennsylvania resident, you can transfer your information directly into the state grant application. And that's it. If you have any questions, you can call the Office of Financial Aid or schedule an appointment with a counselor.